All right, so um, one thing as when I got home, I realized that I neglected to assess her thyroid, which is something that I do pretty much in every exam, so <laughs> go figure. So <clears throat> when you're looking, you know, we looked at her trachea to make sure that it was um, midline and that there's no tracheal tug one way or the other does move freely as well. Um, for palpating her thyroid gland, what I'm going to have you do first is take a drink of this, don't swallow it yet, hold it in your mouth. And then I'm going to shine a light across the side of her neck and go ahead and tilt your chin up and swallow. Good, and I look for free movement of the thyroid gland and also the side view can really show you if she has a full thyroid or not. So now what I'm gonna have you do is again, hold some of this in your mouth, don't swallow it quite yet. And do a posterior exam here. I'm going to feel where her cricoid cartilage is and the thyroid gland is just below that. I'm gonna have her tilt her head forward and to the side. Then I'm going to keep her head forward and to the side forward. Displace the thyroid gland off to my left hand and while I'm doing that, tread forward a little bit more. There you go. Swallow. Good. And I can feel move go ahead. I can feel the movement of her thyroid gland against my fingers. I feel no nodules, no fullness or anything like that. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Just hold it in your mouth. Don't swallow quite yet. And again, feeling that thyroid gland, displacing now towards my right hand and lightly touching the edge there and go ahead and swallow. Good, and you can feel free movement, no nodules, lumps, or fullness of the thyroid gland. Now that concludes our neck exam. <laughs> Bye. And sorry about the background noise.